Sometimes our computers become overwhelmed with files and we have to organize them so we can find things better. Before we start, I want to explain about a few areas of your computer. This area is called your desktop. Sometimes people refer to it as a background or wallpaper. On your desktop are usually icons such as Recycle Bin, My Computer, and My Documents. We're going to start in the My Documents folder. This is a common folder where many programs store files by default. I have five files in My Documents that I want to organize. Before I organize them, I want to change how my files are viewed. If I click on the View drop-down menu, there's a slider bar that changes these things. There are different sizes of icons and they show a thumbnail, which is a preview of what the file is. List just shows the file name, Detail shows the file name with particular details about the file, and Tiles just shows an icon. We're going to choose Details. Up at the top there are different criteria that show information about the particular files. Right now it's showing the name, the size of the file, and the date it was created. But I want to be able to sort by the different types of files. So in this bar, I'm going to right click and I could choose more and there are several different components which I could choose to sort by. I'm going to scroll down and click on type. Now I have the option to sort by the type of file and I can see what kind of file it is. So for example, if I click on name, it sorts alphabetically by name A to Z. You'll notice the arrow pointing up means A to Z. If I click again, now the arrow is pointing down and it's sorting Z to A. I can sort by the size of the files, the dates they were created, and the type. So I'm going to create two folders within my documents to sort my files. To create a folder, right click in an area where there are no icons, click on new, and then click on folder. By default it's named new folder, but I'm going to call mine graphics. I'm going to create another folder and call it word files. Before I move my files around though, I want to change one of the names of one of my files. Click on the file you want to change the name of and then right click with your mouse and go down to rename. I'm going to change it to Gong Gong U Logo and click enter when you're finished. Now that I've renamed my file, I'm going to start moving them around. To select multiple files, there's several ways you can do it. You can click your left mouse key and hold it down while you drag the selector box over the icons. That's one method. You can also, using your mouse, click on one icon and then hold down the control key on your keyboard and continue to click on as many files that you want selected. So I'm going to just select the two that are the Word files. If I wanted to select all these files, I could hold down the control key on my keyboard and press control A and that will select all but I just want to select these two files. So I highlight the two Word files and I want to cut these files and place them in the new Word files folder. There's three different ways I can do this. I can press Control X on my keyboard. I can right click on one of the highlighted icons and click on cut or I could simply click with my left mouse click, hold it down and drag the files until the folder I wish to place them in is highlighted and then release the mouse key. I'm going to do something similar for the graphic files but I want to keep copies of them in two different places. So I'm going to highlight the files and copy them. There's two different ways to copy. You can either press Control C on your keyboard or right click and click on copy. Now I'll go to the graphics folder. To paste, I can either press Control V on my keyboard or right click and click on paste. Back in my documents, I've decided maybe I don't want all these files after all. So I'm going to highlight them and there's two different ways I can delete. I can either press the delete key on my keyboard or I can right click and press delete. It's going to ask me if I really want to put these in the recycling bin. I'm going to say yes. And now they're moved to recycling bin.